Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to avoid redirection from previous my domain URL without an enhanced domain when the enhanced domain is enabled in Salesforce. Um, uh, by next year, all the customer orgs should enable this enhanced domain in Salesforce for security features to avoid attacks and uh, to avoid unnecessary uh, uh, traffic from uh, uh, hackers or uh, uh, other uh, uh, cyber issues we have to make sure this enhanced domain is enabled in our org um, thoroughly test the enhanced domain in a sandbox before you enable it in production there are so many uh, uh, problems you may encounter like SSO issue, IDP provider issue, certificate issue, uh, URL change issue. So like that we have a few issues which we may encounter if we enable enhanced domain. In this video we are going to see how to thoroughly test so that all the integrations are in place. When we enable enhanced domain, if you go to my domain in Salesforce, you will see a section called routing. Make sure you just enabled my uh, enhanced domain uh, and uh, make sure you haven't changed the URL by yourself. If you do both at the same time, you might not see this particular uh, change if you change multiple things at the same time you may not see this particular feature what we are talking about so if you come to my domain if you come to routing uh, section you will see a field or a column called previous my domain URL it will say what is your previous my domain URL and then you will have a checkbox called redirect previous my domain URLs to your current my domain so you have to disable this so that if any of your integration any of your users uses the my domain url without enhanced domain then they will be routed to this new uh, my domain url with the enhanced domain so the, the url is going to be the same mostly it will be the same but if they access it without enhanced domain it will redirect so if you enable this option we may not know whether it is going to work continuously by redirecting us uh, the best option to test thoroughly our integration and users login is we have to disable this feature so if i disable this feature if somebody logs in from a previous my domain url which is without enhanced domains feature then it will fail for them so that's how we will be able to easily find out that um, we are uh, testing it uh, um, um, inappropriately so in order to accurately test it make sure redirect previous my domain URLs to your current my domain URL is disabled I hope it was helpful Thank you for watching.